about to warm up with boxing. You know, I, I usually do the little air shit like that. I'm about to put the fucking gloves on and the lighter. I know a little bit about boxing, not that much, but a little bit. I did a little bit of A1 boxing. <laughs> See if I still got it, you know what I'm sets of five. Um, I did a plate first and then I did a plate and a quarter and then I did two plates and then I end up doing my five sets at a plate, two plates and a dime. And five sets of five and I believe on the last set I did four but I didn't, I didn't want to show you guys all the clips of me um, doing all the five sets because I thought it was just a waste of footage and you kind of get the gist of it. I uh, kind of structure my workouts I always my compound movement, I'll usually do like nine sets to eight sets maybe. Three or four being warm-up sets and then five sets being my working set is usually how I go for strength. Or sometimes I structure it differently, but um, that was this workout when I had my grades. On to the hammer press. Um... Real nice and easy right after. I like going to the hammer press right after bench because of my back. Not because my back hurts or anything, just to preserve my back, you know. Um, I don't want to do too many compound movements that like, involve a lot of core. Because sometimes what I do is on the bench I'll lift my legs up, involve engaging my core. And so I just like to rest my back and just 
straight up focus on the chest. And the hammer press is something that helps me. I don't know. That's what I do. Right after I did uh, flies, cable, no, um, machine flies. I almost said cable flies. I haven't done cable flies in a long time. What I usually do is dumbbell flies. But once again, I kind of want to rest. Like, um, I guess less stress on my shoulders as much. Because with the dumbbells, you have that so much that free range that it can kind of hurt your shoulders. If you go too wide at an angle or anything like that. So I kind of just wanted to change it up and I wanted to use different equipment at uh, Muscle Farm. So I'm trying to get adjusted to all the different kind of workouts. So I can. I've been starting to write my program. So I'm pretty much already set. And I'll, I'll let you guys know that in the next clip what it's kind of like. <laughs> After chest, I go into abs and I do about a hundred crunches. But what I was talking about in my last clip that I'm changing up my workouts. So I'm gonna start doing deadlifts Wednesdays, Mondays chest, Fridays squats. Those are gonna be my three mains. And I don't know, I might have one rest or two rests in between the week. We'll see how that goes, but I'm still kind of structuring my workout program for this cut. Um, being sick held me back, that's why I haven't seen a video in a long time. And this is old footage when I had braids, and I just wanted to get it out there. Um, I had a real big setback just getting the flu. I just didn't want to do any edit, <laughs> any other videos or nothing like that. I just really wanted just to work out and kind of get back. Because now I'm at 200. I was at 200 and 1 from being sick when I was down to 193. And now I'm back down to 196, 197. So I'm making a comeback, so stick with me. More content to come, and... Be strong, trying to encourage you to be strong. Let's get it.